Why, hello everyone. Guess who it is? It's Angela O'Hare, your favorite Las Vegas realtor. And I brought along my sidekick, Damien. Hi everybody. We are over here in a brand new community called Talis by KB Homes. It is right off of Kyle Canyon Road in the northwest part of the Las Vegas Valley. It opened three months ago, so shame on me for getting this out to you late. I honestly didn't know it was here until one of my agents sold in this community, which is pretty cool. So they have the landings and the reserves here in Talis, and they both have six different floor plans to choose from with a total of five models. So we're gonna take a look at right now, model plan 2069, which is 2069 square feet. This floor plan has three to four bedrooms, two and a half baths, two car garage. And the base price is starting at 397,190. I mean, oh my gosh, these prices are unbelievable. Now that price can change and it also depends on the elevation and lot premiums. So when you come in to this 2069 floor plan, you are greeted by stairs. And this is kind of similar to the 2469. The only difference is that it's just slightly one bedroom less. See, as you walk in, you have the kitchen. The kitchen's not as large, um, but you have this big great room. And then there should be a bathroom right here to the, yep, to the back of it. Yeah, I have a friend that has this floor plan over in Summerlin. So you have a closet, a linen closet, and then the half bath. So this is another popular floor plan that a lot of clients like. Instead of having the bedroom downstairs, this has the same feel, as I mentioned, as the 2469 floor plan. And they just call this the 2069. So it's 400 square feet less, obviously, right? Um, I like this floor plan, actually. This pantry is huge. This is bigger than the other one. You should look at it. It's big. Let's see what this note says. Cabinet box size will differ in production. Okay. So they looks like they utilize the white shaker cabinets with a granite countertops in this one. And they also did an uh, engineered, I mean, not engineered, sorry, a luxury vinyl flooring. This is the newest trend right now. And actually, I love luxury vinyl flooring. They look like very, they're very good quality. Mm -hmm. And they're just beautiful floors, very durable. So this is a good open layout. Now, when you buy new construction from ground up, first, let me tell you about this community. There's going to be 231 homes here. The monthly HOA is $65 a month. There are no SIDS or LIDS, which is amazing. It will be a gated community, and there will be a community park as well. So when you buy new construction, you're going to pick your lot, right? You're going to build it from ground up. You pick your lot, and depending on the lot size, you're going to have a different lot premium. So this is a bigger lot than the last lot because it also depends on not only that, this may be bigger or seem bigger than the last model that we toured, but because of how the house is positioned in the front, it may seem like it has a bigger back. Now I do believe with KB, you can have an option of putting the patio cover. So one, you're gonna have a lot premium and that varies in price depending on the lot size and lot location. Then once you go and you decide you like this lot, you're gonna go into contract, you're gonna pick out your structural options. And there's a couple of different structural options. Each builder's different, but you will select if you want to have the gas stub right here, which is highly recommended. Sometimes, I don't know if this house allows it, the different sliders, um, or if you want a garage door in the garage leading to the backyard. So there's different structural options. Then what you're gonna do is after you go under contract, they're gonna make an appointment with you to the design studio, and you're going to make an appointment to pick out all of your upgrades. Now, with these builders, the whole house comes carpeted with the exception of your wet areas, your kitchen, your entry, your bathroom, and laundry. 
If it were me, I would spend the money upgrading the floors and make sure that I get either an engineered hardwood tile or luxury vinyl in lieu of the carpet. We do live in a desert environment. I am personally going through changing out all my floors to an LVP and it's not that cheap. So people say, some people say to go with the builder grade options and then have someone else come in and change the flooring. For me, I would spend the extra and have someone do it before I even moved in. Um, and if I were to carpet anything, I would just only make sure that the bedrooms had carpeting instead of anywhere else. When people buy new construction here in Vegas, they don't want carpet. Carpet is not a big thing here. So if you have to have carpet, just keep it in your bedrooms. Like the stairs, don't put carpet on your stairs. Nope, it's locked. All right. Um, no one likes carpet. That was the garage. Yeah. No one likes carpet. Luxury vinyl is the hottest trend right now. And it's actually more reasonable than engineered hardwood or actually hardwood floors. So just a suggestion. So when you come up, you have the loft area. And then you also have the laundry room and primary bedroom. So we're going to go to the back of the house and save the primary for last. So this one, oh, cute, has a double vanity. And they used a gray quartz countertops with the builder gray tub shower insert, like the floors that they selected. It's a good size secondary bathroom. Then you have a bedroom right here with the closet. Then you have a bedroom right here. So um, my friend that has this floor plan, he converted, I do believe this is a possibility where you can convert this room into one big room Something I can't remember the exact layout, how it happened, but one of these rooms were a lot bigger and the closet was a little different. Just FYI, that's an option. Then you have this bedroom here as well. So these rooms seem to be a tad bit smaller than the 2014, I mean 2469 floor plan. Because this one is modeled as four bedrooms. This must be a linen closet. Yep. And then another, the laundry room. I like the tiles. Those are kind of cute. Mm -hmm. oh, then the primary bedroom. It's a good size primary bedroom. I like how they were consistent with the flooring. The double vanity. Ooh, this is a nice tub for, you know, a builder tub. Wow, that's big. And then they put the quartz around the tub. And I like the black accent right there. That's very nice. This is what I want. Mm -hmm. Something like that. I like this too. Look at this, how clean this is. Yeah. And then with the black accents, this is probably another linen closet. Oh, no. No. Toilet. And then the primary closet. A good size closet. Mm -hmm. Alrighty. So to summarize, we are taking a tour of the plan 2069, which is 2069 square feet, three to four bedrooms, two and a half baths, and a two car garage. Base price is starting at 397,190. And again, that does not include your elevation or anything, your upgrades. They do have three move-in ready homes. So if you're interested in buying this community and want to buy a quick move-in, or if you want to build from ground up, please reach out to me at 702-370-5112. I sell a lot of new construction here in the Las Vegas Valley. I am your new home sales expert. They need to call me, right? Right. But what else do they need to do? Like and subscribe. Like and subscribe, folks. He got it right this time. <laughs> Make sure, let me know in the comments if you uh, have a KB home or if you bought a KB home or if you're planning to buy, let me know. See you guys on the next model home tour. Peace out, folks.